you like my pink socks? <laughs> and I have a fabulous tea to drink. Isn't this like a social media trend? Don't they say something about drinking tea, sipping tea means like there's gossip or drama going around? Because I mean, I guess there's gossip and drama going around about how many unboxing videos I do in like a week. We're gonna put the tea over here. And we're gonna do another unboxing. So I went to my US postal outlet again so that I could pick up multiple parcels. I actually got some stuff related to model versus on the trip. The main thing that I get when I go is tester still coat. So I actually got six cans. Wow. And then I actually bought this, which I didn't think I could get in Canada, but then I was at Home Depot and it was totally there. So we're gonna try this one. I really like Rust-Oleum because they have a really good like spray nozzle. Let's start with the first box. This is good. This is the good stuff. This is the nice soft blowy bubble wrap. Hey! Got that new Briar smell. He's not perfect, but he's very cute. So this is Aintree. This is a Briar Fest special run. 2012. I've been looking for him for a while. He's on the cigar mold. Kind of a buckskinny done color, and I'm a sucker for buckskinny done, so I needed to have him. He was one of the ones that like people aren't super in love with, so he's actually been really cheap most of the time. That's the first dude. Who's the next dude? This guy! <laughs> this is Maestro Gorgeous. I don't know how to say his name. This model I actually don't have. It's on a Solenero mold and it's going to be a body. So I wanted to paint a Solenero. I really love this Solenero mold. It has so much character to it. And I'd love to like re-sculpt his braids. This one doesn't come with a stand. I'm gonna have to build a stand with my boyfriend for him, but I may almost like leave him in the pose he's in. And this one, I know which one this is. Oh, this is a totally different horse than I thought it was. <laughs> okay, so, okay, let's see. This is Chic, and he's in actually pretty rough condition. I was hoping that he would be in nice and condition, but maybe he's okay. He doesn't stand, according to her. So he needs an adjustment on the leg. But he's super cute. I don't know, I love Leopardapalooza. This mold is like kind of clanky and kind of ugly, but the Leopardapalooza is fun, so I wanted to add him to my collection. I kind of have like a semi-collection that like, if I ever have kids, I would love to give them, and these are the kind of horses that I would give them, because it's really fun. This is so exciting. He's a weird color. Oh, but he's awesome. This mold is so freaking fun. Look at him. He looks like he's having the time of his life, and he's got so much hair, and he's like heavy because he has so much hair. So this is Samson. This was the Tractor Supply Company special run. I needed to get him because buckskin. Okay, okay. So this is a uh, Hakan, the other Tractor Special Supply run model. Oh, he does come with the stand. It's perfect. And it is a leopard buckskin Appaloosa. And it's kind of like they stole it from me before I got to do it because this was the color I originally wanted to paint my party jobs and then they did it for me. So they released two buckskin tractor supply special runs and of course I had to get both. And then they also had this one which is very exciting. So I recently fell in love with this mold and now I'm obsessed with it and I want all the models on it. Oh my gosh! What? Oh, he's so pretty. Briar does not do chestnuts enough. Like, just a really nice, rich chestnut. This guy is Caliente, and he was the 2008 Briar Tour Limited Edition model. So he's a little bit older. He's really hard to find. You do not see this guy very often. And um, he's super rich chestnut with like faded, pale dapples in there, and he's just. Stunning. I love this mold. This mold has so much life in the hair and the personality. Fabulous. Just fabulous. I saved the best for last. Oh, but it's full of packing peanuts. Actually, these are green. They match my studio logo, so I like sending things in green packing peanuts. So I'm not even mad about the packing peanuts. So this is very, very exciting. Oh my god, I can't believe I have this model. I didn't think I would ever own this model. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. 
Oh my gosh! His little nose is so pink! This is Galahad. He doesn't actually have a print, which is weird. But he's a Briarfest special run. I'm not sure what year because it doesn't say on his belly. But he's like a chestnut, a darker chestnut with a shimmery mane and tail. So he's very similar to Caliente, but you can definitely tell that he's like more of a silver bay or flaxen chestnut versus like a true chestnut. So I went back and forth with these two models and I'm like, I don't know which one I want. Like, I like them both. So now I have the twin set and I am in love. I love these guys. This has been a pretty good haul, I'd say. This has been fun been a great time, a grand old time. So thank you so much for watching. Happy collecting and achieving holy grails because it's the best thing. <laughs>